but nothing more. Of course, like us all. Like us all. But the thing is, I think I should make some changes in my life. Stop with the drink. Put it down. Stop hanging out with the wrong sort. Can you help me do that? It is a final chance at redemption. Look, whatever you want, I will do my best to help. Good. Give Packy a call. He'll explain what, uh, I need guidance with the most. The areas where I have strayed furthest from the path. See ya. Your brother told me to call you. Jerry wants us to kidnap old man Ancelotti's daughter. Some fake tan, dyed hair, Guido loving slut by the name of Grace. She's selling her tasteful pink felter on auto erotica at the moment. Get online, organize a viewing, and snatch that bitch. When you got her, bring her to a place we got on an alleyway off Sacramento. I can do that. You can do anything, Nico. Don't let her on that you're kidnapping her near her place, though. Play along with a test drive for a while to get her out of there. It's a real mobbed up area, and they'll come down on you damn heavy. Aren't you going to hell? One of my fucking brothers just got shot, and another one's in the pen. Someone's got to be with my ma. Don't play with the window. Thank you very much. Nico, I got a grieving mother to look after. I don't want to worry about you not kidnapping some Guido bitch like you've been asked to do. Hey, Packy, I had other stuff to do. I'll get on it, all right? I'll speak to you soon. I'm, uh, calling about the car. Come to my place on Babbage Drive. You don't sound like the sort of man who drives a pink convertible. Well, I, I can't resist the bargain. So, uh, can you... guy who calls about the car, the one with the sexy accent. <laughs> you mind if I take a test drive? You can test drive whatever you want. I love riding in cars with you European types. My family's from Italia, you know, somewhere in the south. Why don't you drive towards the south coast? We can enjoy the day. Calculating route. Yeah, that's it. 
I'll take this piece of ass. Guys, the beach better be worth the trouble. The pa's got some serious cash. And he pissed off Gerald. That's reason enough for me. Well, they better pay quick. I hate to think of the fight she'll put up if you try to cut her fingers off. has the bitch. I'm done with her. Thanks, Nico. My brother will be a happy man. I'll get things in motion. Be in touch. I didn't see you there, pal. Forgive me. Can I have 
your bike. your bone. What are you waiting for? Throw it. There's some fellow called Talbot. Talbot Daniels over in the triangle. He's into me for about 10 G's and he says he might know something about Florian Kravitz. Florian! These days of searching are over, my friend. This guy should point you in the right direction. Can you do me a favor? Anything for you, cousin. Just famous. You want some women? I met the... He's not that. I'm coming to collect you from the apartment. Wait for me there. Great to be here. I brought you samples of some great through the You look like you really need them. Thanks. Largest HMO in the nation. Copay Health System CEO, Mason Taylor Senior. Ryan, it's a pleasure to be here to talk about taking the healthcare industry from a patient-centric and business-centric. Let's do it, thank the you. Downhill medicine man himself. Come on, and be you think what? I can't ah. walking? Go get us a card! Uh, let's start with you, Mason. What's wrong with the healthcare industry? I have found Florian Kravich. There's a man called Talbot Daniels who will lead us to him. Talbot? I know him from some of the card games I play. So, we're finally going to kill Florian Kravich. You know, if this fucks up, the bad shit's coming down on my head! What do you mean? I mean you fuck up and I take this shit! You kill the wrong guy, and his friends will fuck with me! They get to you! I didn't have no scars until you arrived! Now I am practically chopping board to have so many cuts on me! You are a rich chopping board! I worry for you, MB. Sometimes you just gotta let the hate go! You really going to feel better once Florian is dead? Soon, we will find out. There he is. Let's go talk to him. He's always at the games being held around Algonquin. Not too good, either. I don't think I've seen him win a hand. Hey! I hear you know Florian Kravich. Where is he? Florian Kravich? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. I've been head-to-head -head with this guy a few times, NB. I know his tells. He's lying. Roman, what's this about? He doesn't act well under pressure, NB. Beat him a little. All right already. There's a guy I know, likes to be called Florian Kravik at, um, certain moments, lives uptown somewhere. Show me. I'm sorry. It doesn't. People will see an inverse reduction in problems. It's science, really. Life is stressful, and the reason it's stressful is that the consumer is forced Get in, to and don't try anything stupid, Talbot. Absorbent fees to cover these prescriptions and CEO bonuses. HMOs like mine are trying to save your life. And Little Miss Drug Company here sashays into the doctor's office. Where is he? Why aren't we there yet? Okay, um, if I'm right, Bernie's place is somewhere uptown. Keep going up here. The insurance companies, which we are obliged to mark up and pass on to you in deny coverage claims. It breaks my heart. There's just, there's just too many pills, man. It's Turn right. My immune system is weak. My mom was a, was a, was a visionary and a, and a helper. You know, and she left me in dirty diapers all day. And now I have a super goddamn immune system. I can lick uh, the food. This isn't easy. Oh, I think if I'm not wrong, it's straight. Maybe if you um took a left here. Right at this one! Loser. Not my fault, buddy. And the last thing we need on Earth is socialized medicine. Sheesh. Can you imagine the straight ahead? Uh you might have to keep going here. Hey, slow down. I can't see the turns. Left on this one. 
because of paperwork and lack of coverage and their failure to understand the small print. <laughs> okay, Lennon, I understand. You want to live in a socialist utopia. Fair enough. Well, I don't. I want choices. I want access. Okay, I think you should maybe turn right. I want the chance to look you in the eye and say, I've got it, you have it. This is it. This is Bernie's place. Are you going to kill him? When I'm done with Florian, he will be begging to die. That is the most your friend can look forward to. Get out of here now! You've done your job. Nico, be calm! Be calm! Fuck! Calm! <sighs> Florian! On the son's book, Tebe, Durkajior! Otvori! Florian! I've come for you, Florian! Oh! Go away! Florian, Yesitoti. Nico? What the hell are you doing here? What happened to you? Oh, I started working out. You know, toned up the... Uh... Florian? You used to work in the abattoir? Oh, don't remind me. Roman? You put on a few vanity pounds. Uh, what are you guys doing here? Why did you kick my door down? I've come uh, to ask you some questions. It wasn't you, was it? What was it, me? Who set us up? It was you or Darko. I thought it must be him. Oh, my God. You think it was me? That's why you are here. You've come to kill me. Well, screw you, Nico Bellic and fatty Roman. It wasn't me, it wasn't. I wouldn't do that. <sighs> Can we stop with the fat jokes, Florian? It's Bernie now. After I came here, I wanted a complete change, so I became Bernie Crane. I'm sorry about the fat thing. You're still kind of cute. <laughs> Gee, thanks. What are you doing here? Well, I'm a lifestyle coach, and I teach an aerobics class, and I'm in love. He's married. It's so doomed. And he's in politics. <sighs> he's the deputy mayor. <laughs> Bryce Dawkins? But he's so at the family values. Oh, uh, that's just politics. Where is Darko? Dead, I hope! Uh, I'm not sure. I, I, I heard he was still in Europe or Switzerland or somewhere. But then I heard that you had joined the circus, so information can be unreliable. We have to find him. We have to find him. I think he's a bit freaked out. I guess he thought seeing you would answer some questions. So I see. Well, it's great to see you guys. We must do brunch. Sure. See you later, Florian. Bernie! So, Florian has changed? Yes. He's moved on from what happened to you. You should have moved on too. What are you going to do? He may not be here in Liberty City, but he's still out there. I will find out where Darko Brevich is, and I will make him answer for his actions. We know now that it was him. I need to be alone now, Roman. Sure. I'll see you later then. Call me, okay? Hey, watch the body, pal. Fuck! Sorry! Excuse me! Nicky, you like him? He wasn't the one I was looking for. Too bad, Chich. I did what I could. Please, excuse me. Pardon. Forgive me! Where to? Oh, that's a good point. What do you mean by that? So...
Smuggle drugs Here we go. Tip, so please. Malik, I want to introduce you to John Gravelli, head of the Gambetti family. He needs help. I'm already working for a mafia family. They're scum. The Pegorino? They're not a family. Gravelli is the only man who can get what you need done. He's in Shotla Medical Center. Tell him you were sent by a mutual friend. He's expecting. How's my favorite girl? We need a picture of Grace. Her pa thinks she's holed up with some guy. You don't believe we got her. Will you do it? Ma's still upset. So I'm a portrait photographer now, am I? Okay, I'll send you it on my phone. And you end up stoning them to the tits on exciting new breakthrough. Please make a huge and you were in 50 yards. Turn left. In 200 yards. Turn left. Definitely. And we're happy to cover everything as long as you reach your $10,000 deductible. Isn't that great? We cover all the expenses after you've spent $10,000. In 50 yards. Turn right. So I hear you found the big bad monster you are. Bernie Crane, the muscle Mary? Come on. Fuck you. You think I wouldn't have fingered him in a second if he was your guy? You could have told me he was here. I'm helping you find the man you're after. I'm not some reunite old boyfriend, so this. Look, I was in the army. I know it gets low. I know what it feels like to get close to a man. I'm sure you do, but you said you'd help me. I've already helped you. But I'll help you again. Wait for me to be in touch. That's a fact. What works is a fully integrated... Come on, Gracie. I want you looking pretty for the photo. <laughs> Smile for your daddy, Grace. Fuck you! I can't even hear it Where am I? Have fun out there! Dick, call a terrorist police! Lottie won't believe his girls hold up with a guy no more. Not unless that guy is into some sick shit. Later on, Becky. What can I do for you? I need you to come around to my place, Nico. Please, come soon. I'm here to see Mr. Gravelli. I was sent by a mutual friend. Come on. Uh, someone here to see you. Here. 
so you're the one who's getting involved with that nonsense for my dear friend, James Pegorino. I don't know what you Spare you're... me, please. I'm an old man. I ain't got much time left. Our mutual friend told me everything. Thank you. It made me <laughs> <laughs> My pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> people are so damn vain. Some people? <clears throat> All people. Even you, even me, an old man facing the end. And I still care. Care how I look. Care that when I shit myself, the pretty nurse has to clean it up. It's, it's ridiculous. Yeah, well, uh, <sighs> you know. And I care about my legacy. I've worked hard for this, this line of work. Now some Russian assholes think they can march in and take control of rackets my family has run for 50 years! <laughs> you mean 50 years of you bleeding the city dry might finally come to an end? <laughs> I know, it's a terrible <laughs> tragedy. <laughs> But if it wasn't me, it would just be someone else. So it might as well be me. Yes. Let me tell you, that faggot friend of yours, Bernie Crane, his boyfriend, he's being blackmailed by them damn Russians. They want him to put certain contracts up for tender. Windows, bus lines, cleaning, ones we control. These Russian fucking bastards are trying to finish us. What do you want me to do about it? I want you to work with me. In exchange for what? The police have a file on you an inch thick. In exchange for that. In exchange for that guy you've been asking about being brought here from wherever it is he's hiding, Switzerland or some shit. Okay, good. What do you want me to do? A good friend of mine is coming into town to give a speech on the new threat to Liberty City. Russian organized crime. I got a feeling some people ain't gonna want that speech to happen. Maybe the guy you love, this Dmitry Raskolov, has an interest in keeping this story out of the press. Make sure our boy gets to City Hall. <coughs> He's coming in from upstate. He'll be at Grand Eastern Terminal on Bismarck. <coughs> Thank you. with 
many men. Not for you. His name? Albert? Uh, no, it's Richard. Yes, yes, you're right. Very good. He had a brother. You guys waiting for me? Nico Bellic, right? Yeah, that's me. Stay in convoy with us all the way to City Hall. All right? Sure. John, how are you? Of course. Well, I'm coming to see you as soon as I've delivered the speech. Don't say that, John. You'll be feeling like a teenager again in no time. Those are the wonders of modern medicine. Oh, I'm gonna bring up everything we discussed. When I'm done at the podium, Mayor Ochoa is gonna be dedicating half his annual budget to cleaning this problem up. <laughs> he doesn't want to start getting reckless with the lives of Liberty City voters. No, John. Driver, why is this road closed? Is there a problem? Another roadblock? This definitely wasn't mentioned on the traffic report. I'm gonna go and move the barriers. Come on, Mr. Jefferson! Let's get out of here! I guess. You do that, Mike. More Russians wanting to kill you. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> 